So the Leprosarium is about a 45 minute walk from uh, where we're staying here and um, it's along a dirt road on the side of a cliff and uh, it's down into the valley so you walk the dirt road go down into the valley and the Leprosarium is uh, kind of like a group home if you can imagine uh, a bunch of little houses all combined and connected to form a little community and we went last week uh, for the first time and did some restorative yoga with all the people that live there. It was great. It was like spending some time with uh, my grandmother and all her sisters in the Italian kitchen, basically. <laughs> yeah, we focused on, like Mark said, a lot of restorative postures. So what we did first was we formed a circle and we asked everyone what kind of ailment they were experiencing in their body and surprisingly a lot of a lot of them were the same as Americans often talk about yeah. low back pain joint pain arthritis um, a couple people had high uh, blood pressure and high cholesterol so we took that information and then we really started working with the low back we did very simple postures and all we used were two pillows that they had in a room and the floor was already carpeted with these beautiful rugs and we used a uh, one chair, a long bench, and a table. It's very simple tools, and each person got individual attention. And the the thing that struck me the most was, before I went there, I wasn't sure uh, what kind of body types I would be working with, and what kind of deformities would prevent these people to to move or to do some type of yoga postures. And when we got there, you know, uh, their hands weren't really usable, and their feet but we could, we could really move their bodies into poses that they didn't want to get out of. They yeah, they felt, loved it. <laughs> they felt so relaxed. <laughs> They're like, ah. <laughs> it so, was hilarious. And then they were laughing and joking with each other, and it was, it was a really great experience. Yeah. It was really great. Yeah, and I think the most significant thing was putting my hands on every single person. Erica, and we'd like to thank Give Back Yoga for providing us all the mats to teach yoga to the villagers here, right outside of Kathmandu in Nepal. Thank you very much for your generous donation. Thank you.